Hello everyone. Thank you so much for tuning into my first voiceover video. I'm definitely very nervous, but at the same time, I'm also very excited. <laughs> to introduce myself, my name is Ashley, and I'm a illustrator from Malaysia. And today's video is a time lapse video of me painting a canine portrait. Now this painting is a challenge for me at the beginning. I don't usually paint dogs, so this is my second attempt at it. You can probably imagine how much my mind is racing with challenges I might face while painting. <laughs> so speaking about challenges, it is not necessarily a bad one. Sometimes challenges can result in growth if you keep an open mind. Challenges really make everyday life much more exciting because you may not know what's the end result and that keeps you going forward. It keeps you yearning for growth and improvement and I'm pretty sure that's what every artist is looking for. So in this painting, I observe the flow lines of the face, understanding how the feature goes. And then I started with the eyes because that is a rather important feature, more like the main focus of a portrait. Once I got the base done, then I move on to the cheeks, the ears, and so on uh, to actually balance out the feel of the overall painting. Painting the snout is my personal favorite because of the tiny details at the mouth, the nostrils, and it's, it's just very cute. <laughs>
for several layers to actually make sure the colors are all even. That's actually a real time of me painting. I really take it slow and sometimes I take a break thinking what's the next step, what's the next thing to do. And this is my favorite part of the process where I actually do some minor tweakings, uh, like adding some some textures on the snout and also I also add um, a white gouache to actually accentuate the whiskers. I hope you enjoy watching this video. If you would like to see more of this painting voiceovers thing, let me know in the comments down below. I'll be doing my best to post videos every week, so please stay tuned, subscribe, and don't forget to visit my Etsy shop. I actually have some stickers and some new prints. I hope you have a, a great fruitful day, and I'll see you around. Bye!